Miller greetings, Mary Tubians. Welcome back to Story of Seasons of Wonderful Life, where we continue living our life on Harper Farm in this, our second autumn or fall for our, our American friends. And again, my husband is out wandering in the evening. Now, we are expecting Van's visit to take place within this episode. Oh, I always get sad when I see that picture. Um, so we should be seeing some van and thus making some money, which is good because we just bought a cow and it's expensive. And good luck today. Still haven't worked out what luck actually does for us. Hello, my midget person. And snugs. Hi. You're not a very adventurous child, are you? I'm blaming your father for that one. Maybe that'll change when you next age up. Really need to take you out to let you see me working on the farm more. Should check where your skills are at. Okay, down you go. There we go. Should also possibly give gifts to my husband. I don't know. Might help things along a bit, but we do have many a critter living with us now. We are very contented, very happy with our lives, very unable to actually brush this sheep. There we go. It's been a very odd day in the reality that is Ronan Tia's life, so <laughs> forgive me if I'm a little bit weirder than normal today. There we go, and talk. Roger looks all healthy. Shari is doing well with her lamb. I'm really worried about the existence of. You're fair in a snuggle. Ah, oh, you're asleep. Okay. Melinda's all happy and filled with joy. Oh, and it looks like. Butters has woken up. Wait, did I grab the wrong save? Oh no. I'm gonna need to put out more food though, because everybody's eating everybody's stuff. Bree is looking energetic. Bree being the newest member of our family. Alright, let's put you all outside. Still got chickens we need to take care of and 20 gabillion de vegetables. Oh, we've got a kitty now, too. Morning, Charcoal. Good morning, Daffy. Good morning, madam. Nice. You live up to your name. I should probably look to hatch another chicken at this point. I, 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 I think our egg output is sufficient to our needs, so... I'm not really certain if there's much purpose to additional chookering. Alright, now you guys are all maxed out from a fertilizer perspective. So I just need to water you all. And I think you guys are maxed out now as well. You look like you've got that colour. Yeah, yeah, everybody over here is the best that it can be. And 
I really need to put some stuff away. You guys, on the other hand, seem to need fertilizing forever. Is there a cap on fertilizing trees? I've yet to get a better fruit out of this. Am I just wasting fertilizer? Is there another way to get higher quality trees? And obviously I could, if I can get some S grade fruit, I can chop these trees down and create seeds and just grow the S grades from scratch, but... Oh, we've got to go see Vinny today. I'm fairly sure I neglected him yesterday. Alright, where'd I put my watering can? I do also hope that everybody is joining in and enjoying the Rune Factory 3 playthrough that we're doing. Um, at the moment that is running Tuesdays and Thursdays, but if you would like to see me expand that out to take over the Monday, Wednesday... Oh, no point watering these. They have come up faster. Hey, yes, great sweet potatoes! You will be able to make much better seeds. Um, yeah, if you would like me to sort of switch it up and, and start doing Rune Factory 3, three days a week, and this two days a week, I have half an idea that I want to try doing both games five days a week, but I also have half an idea that that might kill me. So, <laughs> um, yeah, that, that one's going to require a bit more thinking on, because we do have Harvest Moon Winds of Anthos coming up. And I definitely, definitely want to be covering that because I don't feel like the Natsume Harvest Moons get the love that they deserve. Um, and I understand the reason for a lot of people choosing not to like them, but at the same time, I think they're amazing games and I want to be sharing them with the universe. By and large... Are they like second tier fruits? I don't even know what sort of fruits these are. Are they porringes? Alright, let's go see some sprites for some recipes. And then... What was the other thing I said I needed to do today? I need to see Vinny. And I probably should work on some friendships and check for some flowers and... Say hi to Pui! Oh, I've got to find you your fishy! I'm just here to chat. Why not eat the mushroom? Turnberry cake. Have I made turnberries yet? I feel like they're a winter fruit. Because it's strawberries and turnips. Have I grown enough turnips to create things? Is that what I'm growing right now? Does anybody remember what I've planted other than carrots? No? Okay, good. Um, also, does anybody know where I get this Amur catfish from? Like, which water source is it? So I'm sure I've caught one. I just... I don't remember the where. Was it a river fish? Yeah, it's me, Gary. I still love you. I miss her too. God, I haven't been over here for days. I am such a bad farmer. The queen of neglect I am. Alright, uh, we've got today's quests up. Hi Lou! Uh, 
Okay, checking for shrooms. I feel like I really need to sit down and just make a list of all the things that I want to get done. So that I know what I'm targeting, because... I constantly feel a little bit lost in this particular game, which is not like me in a farming sim. I'm generally pretty, hey doc, I would like to say hello. Oh. Twins get along, okay. Um, yeah, I frequently feel a bit at odds with this game, like I'm not actually making progress or achieving anything, and for a farming sim that is for me very very rare but I generally set myself little micro goals in every game and am able the plants are all green yes they are particularly this one okay so I'm, I'm still friends enough with you that I don't have to worry Blue crops and along with another fruit or veggie. Something fun. Oh, okay, alright. I do need to make some more of the blue crops. So maybe I can look at that. Because, yeah, we've, we've not made as many blue crops as I might have liked. Now, we have made blue tomatoes, but do I still have seeds for those? Pea blue, apple, organized blue, very yeah, cute, mellow blue. Alright, so I need to get blue on most of the rest of this stuff. That's okay, because we've got plenty of trick blues around, so that's all fine. Um, but I'm also going to need to clear space if I want to do that, so... And this does make for a much longer episode. I'll put all of this stuff away. Um, yeah, we'll pack up the fishies for now and come back for them later. I might do that off camera. But I've really got to find that catfish for Pui. Because I don't want to let Pui down. Because Pui is my favourite. Far and away. What have I got here? Papples. Right. So we've got oranges, papples, and ablus. We have the best looking sweet potatoes on the planet. Is there a bluet? I, f I feel like there's a blue carrot. I suspect we may be growing one. You know what? I'm growing more S grade carrots. I'm not going to worry too much about that. Um, but we also don't have a lot of veggies just available in this fridge. Where are all of my turnips and stuff? Are they in the house? Yeah, okay. Alright, this be where they is. I'll take the uh, tomato. Take the big red turnip. And again, it's all just fruit. Make some more blue elons. We're not going to be able to grow those until next season at this point, but. Yes. Put away the eggs. I really should make some more soup and stuff. Um. Alright, so that gives us blue melons, blue watermelons, another blue tomato, possibly a blue carrot. And can I do... what happens if I mix, like, pebbles and oranges? Is there a third type of fruit? Hey Daisy! Alright, Vinny, what can you do for me? Alright, now I'm going to displease you with this, and I'm sorry for that, my man. I really do feel for you. 
I am also a hater of carrots. Hey, I do have carrot blue seeds. Okay. Yes, please. All right, now you have mixed tomatoes and trick blues before, so that's fine. Yes, please. Um, can I mix a sweet potato and a trick blue? Plain old seeds. Oh, what if I go the other way? Also, do you give me S grade seeds? Yeah, you do. Okay, so I'm not losing anything there. Um, what if I go trick blue and sweet potato like that? Okay, yeah, the order does make a difference, and I can't work out why. Alright, we have blue sweet potatoes. Sweet blues. Autumn only. Alright. I will make a few more of those. First, I want to see if porringers and papples give me anything. Alright, little porringe seeds. What about papple and porridge? Ah, interesting that it's always porridge. Can I make a blue porridge? No, okay. Fruit doesn't work like that. <laughs> Can I make a blue grape? I don't know if I've tried that. I feel like I should have. Okay, that just makes grape seeds. And if I go the grape and then the trick blue. Oh, that's got us something. Bleeps. Grablues. Grablues. Okay, all year round. I think that covers a lot of our blues. Um, what happens if I mix a tomato and a melon? Ah, uh, melatoma. Right, and what happens if I mix a watermelon and a tomato? Gritomas, yep, okay. Trick blue and a melon? Oh. Yes, please. A melon and a trick blue. No. Okay, there's no blue melon mix. Interesting. Is there a blue watermelon? Yes. Does the order matter, or am I just stupid? Water blue seeds! Alright, so what happens if I mix a blue tomato, a blue apple and a tomato? Blue tomatoes. Uh, what if I mix a blue apple and a watermelon. More water blues. Okay, so that's just giving me apparently the blues. So what if I mix a melon and a blue apple? Mellow blues. Um, about a blue apple and a papple. Our blues. Alright, last one. We're gonna try the blue apple and the porridge. Pea blues. Okay, so it's taken the peaches. Interesting. We will have to go through and grow a lot of these, but for now they're just going into storage. Because not a lot of them, I believe. Caro blues might be. Yeah, mellow blues are a, a definite no. 
Yep, spring to autumn, so I'll put you guys away. Honestly, the Ablu seeds will probably just sell. Yeah, you guys are autumn only. I'll probably make some more of those off camera. Flowering summer and fruiting in autumn. I should be able to plant you right away though. Um, pea blue. I believe I'm already growing a pea blue. You guys are useless to us right now. Summer to autumn. Useless. Spring to autumn. Useless for now. Yes. Yes. So we do have a lot of... Where was that caribou? Because I don't think... Oh, autumn to winter. Okay, alright. I can grow that now. But apparently I've made that before, which means I must have one in the ground already. Hey, tiny kitty. Oh. Hey, various critters. Still blue. Guys are not yet sprouted. We'll grow the caribou. Let's see if we can go find this fishy. So I've tried the bottom pond, the top of the river. I will try this section of the river, see if we can't find this catfish. Cannot actually remember what the other request was, or if I have the stuff for it. I do know that I need to use some of my blue fruits and stuff for meals. And I really do need to be cooking more often. Alright, Wakasagi. Come on, fishy. More Wakasagi. Come on. Oh, I did need this today. Alright, one more cast, and if it's still a wakasagi, I'm going to go try the ocean. I do know there's a secondary fish type in here, I just can't remember what it is. Well, all I'm catching today is wakasagi, so let's go try the beach. And for some reason saying that has now put the tune for let's go fly a kite in my head. I don't even know why. Yep, I'm going to be singing that for hours now. Fantastic. Alright, fish off the shelf. That's a big fishy silhouette. That's hopeful. That's promising. Come on, fishy. Don't let me down. I either need calamari so I can spoil my husband. Red Sea Marine. Alright, the only other place I haven't tried yet is the Goddess Pond, but also I've only seen one of the river fish. 
I might actually have to cheat and Google this. I really don't like needing to do that. I could also go back over my previous videos and see where I was when I caught that fish, but that feels like work. In you all go. Please tell me you've left some eggs. Alright, we have a fertilized egg. Let's just do a. Uh, oh, golden egg. Nice try on hiding it, whoever that was. There's the other one. Also a fertilized egg, I believe. I forgot to put out food for everybody. Because I am a mean animal mother. So we will do that right now. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I believe we'll feed everybody. Okay, you already ate. No! I'm here to brush and feed you all. That does not mean you should fall asleep. Brush up, brush up, brush up. And have a chat to my little marble cow. I'm not trying to show the brush. Why does it keep doing that with the little ones? Is it a height thing? Butters is in a good mood. Butters just got hand fed by a beautiful woman. Uh, the sheepy are all asleepy. Let's go give the chooks their love. Did I miss you this morning, Crackers? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to miss you. Alright. All chooks have had extra love. Crops are watered, trees are shook, everything's fertilized. And it's only half past nine. I'm feeling pretty good about the day. I almost got to see my beloved daughter before she went to sleep. Let's get... Actually, he likes top-of-the-line stuff, doesn't he? It's worth wasting a sweet potato for my love. Not like I'd do that much for him. Worst wife. Alright, Van should be visiting today. We are almost. That sweet potato made my whole day. Morning. Yeah, the flowers are pretty. Eve's been all chatty today. Snugs. Snugs. Do the other kids ask to for things other than hugs? Or is my girl just very needy? Uh, 
should check his stats. It's been a while. Put you down. Let you do your thing. Should also make some sweet potato seeds. Hey, Babs the Floof. Alright, now I can't brush you. What's going on? I can't tell if there's something going wrong with my um, Joy-Cons or if I'm just really bad at this. Either option is viable. And sharing. Okay, you're asleep so I'm not going to do much. Hey, Belinda. Looking all sleek and shiny there. Snuggle. Chat. How long is it going to take you to grow up, butters? Hopefully not too much longer. And Bree. What prey horrors will Van be foisting upon my wallet today? I really do need a better fishing rod. But, oh, that's a very colourful looking field. We like colourful. Colourful implies fruits and vegetables. We got some happy duckies. I do apologise to everyone if my randomly deciding to sing sentences is annoying. I know that I'm incredibly off key. I'm I'm tone deaf IRL, so I 100% respect if you guys would rather that I not do that. Alright, all chooks are happy and contented. Let's go see what all those pretty colours were about. Oh, I misinterpreted my pretty colours. But we've got some melons. We got melons. But we aren't through yet. Negatory on the carrots. Carrots take forever. I remember this from last year. I don't even remember what I was growing here. These strawberries? I feel like I was growing strawberries somewhere. Wrong button. Why did I plant so many fruit trees? Part of me just wants to chop them all down and go back to only having one of each. But at the same time, I have put so much fertilizer into these, I would like to see a higher grade of fruit. It really struggles with the camera around this section. Oh, look at all these pretty things we're growing. Alright, who needs fertilizer? You do. You do. You do. Did I ever remember to fertilize this lot yesterday? I think I was so distracted by the sweet potatoes being up that I completely forgot about it. And 
I think I forgot this lot too. Or do these guys just not need fertilizing anymore? They look like they've got that kind of color to them where... Yeah, no, no fertilizer needed. Ah, you guys do though. I thought that you were done. Well, I'm a bad plant grower, that's okay. Van will be opening up any minute. And I've still got to swing by the thing and grab the stuff. I might sell the star milk as well, the S quality plus that I've got, or maybe half of it. And keep some of it for requests. Um, and I will sell the fertilized eggs because I'm really not looking to add more chicken. And I don't think I can hatch a duck. Um, we'll probably sell off Haven some of the weird fruits and vegetables. And spare seeds. So we're going to go into town with an absolute truckload of stuff. As if we had an actual truck. In fact, I might even skip over the sprites today. There is still this one full grown one right there. There we go. Hey, I did it! Even without being able to see! Alright, let's grab some stuff. Go see the Van Meister. Um. Yeah, we'll sell four of those. And the fertilized eggs. I think I've got a couple in the other fridge. To keep, and I think that that should about do us. I didn't feed that turnip to Vinny. Alright, we will come and see you in a moment, my sweet and wonderful Pui. Looks like Trick Blues are up as well. I would like to sell the things, Van. I feel like this worked last time. Change my mind. I say that's fantastic, thank you. I'd like to sell off my lesser value stuff. Um, so we will sell you 10 regular milk. Because I've got plenty. Sell you these four. Uh, these spare seeds. I will sell you four of my precious sweet potatoes. Five of my ablus. Three of my papples. And all of my fertilized eggs. That should make a pretty penny. I am down with that. That sounds good to me. I want to buy. What do you have for sale? No, nothing. Okay. I'm good. Uh, go pick some flowers and find me a catfish. Because I've only got a couple of days left to do that one. Hey, Gustafa.
And of course Van's here, so Carter is out and about, so I can't go digging. That is absolutely... Gustafa, thank you. This is why we're not married, sir. So. You just think you can push me around while you're admiring nature? That's not how this works. Alright. What was the other quest? High quality milk. A rank milk. I've got to go find Sebastian. That's fine. We can do that. Um, is there... A list of fishies. That's how to upgrade my fishies. Um, fish lists. Thank you, Fogu. Uh, a mirror catfish in the marsh. Where's the marsh? Alright, that must be the area with the... Yeah. Alright, oh, let's find Sebastian. He is up at the villa. And the marsh must be that little place where we just picked all the flowers, so... We will go back to fishing that spot until I find me this catfish. Oh, Sebastian! Hey, Cecilia! Sorry, Cecilia. Hmm, no answer. So, Seb must be out of doors. There he is. I'm here about your request. And thank you for the orange seeds. And did I just see a herb? I did. I really should come up here more often. To all the people who romance Lumina, how did you manage to travel up here every day? It's just so far out of the way. Alright, so yeah, I'm guessing that this is the marsh pond, given its coloration and everything, so let's just hope we get us a catfish. I know that I've caught one before. Yay! Did he specify a size? My beloved Pui. Any size. Alright, we'll see if we can get him a bigger one, just because, you know, it's Pui. We, we want to be nice, because he's our favourite. Over and above even our beloved husband and our adorable child. Is that rain? That is rain. I should go put the animals in. Alright, we're only getting little, so that's alright. We'll go give a little fish to Pui and some money if he's begging, and then we're going to go put the animals inside before they get cranky at me. He is not begging. Which means I don't know where he is, so let's put the animals in. I do love the cartoon sound effect. I know that rain and snow and the like have 
very little effect on the critters in this particular version of the game. But putting them away when it's raining is a habit I would rather keep. thought you could hide from me, little googie egg. You thought wrong. Alright, so that means that we are now... What, a third of the way? To the... Where is Pui? There's Lou. Eyes down the beach, of course. Where else would he possibly be when I'm looking for him? Except for the other end of the map. What was I saying? I'm sure whatever it was, it was vastly entertaining. And in some way, shape or form relevant to anything. Thank you, Van. Right, where is my adorable little ragamuffin? There he is. I'm coming. I'm here about your request. Where'd the fishy go? Out oh, there. Aww. You are awesome, Fui. Does anybody else find themselves focusing on one or two characters to the exclusion of all else in this one? I feel like in other farming sims or, or harvest moons or stories of seasons, I'm a little more even-handed with my talking to everybody. It, in this one, I really struggle to talk to anybody who's not a personal favourite. Wait. Okay, there he is. I should talk to Vinny. Egg soup. Hey, Yunk. Hmm? It is for you. That's right, I was going to do some cooking, wasn't I? I'll just say hi to Vinny and then I'll tend the critters. And we might wrap it up at that point. Ah, uh, yep, that's just telling me about the flowers that will make things special. Sorry, Vin. I feel like I've let you down somehow. Roger's all sparkly. And Babs is happy and healthy. Sherry's doing all right. How you doing, butters? How you doing, Bree? Uh oh, Melinda doesn't sleep. Oh, she woke up. She heard me. Oh, 
foot and this is not rune factory the go button is a not I may as well hand feed you one hey bell Thank you for all the tasty milk. I don't know why I keep sounding off in song. Seems to be hitting me a lot today. Maybe I've just gone round the twist. Maybe it's the fact that it's a warm, oh, a warm summer's day in September. It's not supposed to be warm for another couple of weeks yet. Maybe it's because today is the release of the new Pokemon DLC. Maybe it's just because it's Wednesday. Alright. Nothing's ready to pluck or shake or anything. It's pouring down rain, so that feels like a really good time to call it. My daughter is asleep. My husband is staring at a blank television. Maybe I should buy him a DVD player. Uh, we'll look into it. Uh, so we are going to wrap it up there. In our next episode, we will finish out our second autumn and enter into winter, which will be our last season of our second year. I don't know if we get a third year, if we're going to get another time skip before year three. I guess we'll find out. But until next time, it's going to be Ronan Tears signing off.